Today we are going through the shopping haul. I hope you like shopping hauls. I love watching shopping hauls and I love seeing my own shopping hauls. I put everything out and think, wow, look at this. This is great and it looks amazing. As you can see, I've bought celery, onions, apples, lots of apples, <laughs> pears, lots of strawberries, fennel, kale. I've got butter, um, butternut, a pumpkin, cabbage, lettuce, bananas, kale. Did I mention kale? I think I mentioned kale. Um, broccoli, rainbow chard, red capsicum. So it, it was a good shopping haul. I did source from three different locations. First location was the shopping supermarket. I don't usually buy a lot of fruit and veg from the supermarket. Just happened to be in there, picked up a couple of things, and they were the, the bagged items that you can see there, the apple and the capsicum, but also the fennel as well. I love adding fennel to salads, and the red capsicum is for the cheesy sauce. The items I sourced from the fruit and veg market were the celery, the pumpkin the onions the strawberries and that's about it oh and the bananas and the bananas i sourced from there everything else was from the farmer's market so it's organic and obviously local and so you can see more apples <laughs> so we're gonna have a lot of granny smith apples the bosch pears look at that beautiful lettuce and that stunning cabbage look at that purple cabbage it is stunning he chopped it right there in front of me thinking that is beautiful broccoli and rainbow chard and the kale so we've got the red kale as well so that's all from the farmer's market now let me tell you how much i spent on each so at the supermarket for the three items the apples the cap capsicum and the fennel that was ten dollars fifty not bad it was okay it wasn't great it wasn't too bad it was okay from the fruit and veg, that's where I got the butternut pumpkin, the celery, the onions, the strawberries, the bananas. That was $11.71. I think that's pretty good for all of that. And then I spent $19 at the farmer's market. So a little bit more pricey, but you know, I like to throw in some organic in there, but I also like to support the the local farmers as well, that you know, the small farmers. So this is my shopping haul and look at that rainbow chart. How amazing does that look? I made that into a stir fry. The Bosch pears chopping up for the kids. They love them. Or well, bananas. Bananas are bananas. They're all gone by now. But anyway, <laughs> they've all been eaten. So the, the pumpkin, I've already made a pumpkin soup that I made in the multi cooker. And I used uh, onion, garlic, pumpkin and sweet potato so I had some sweet potato I just used what I had and it was amazing and the wonderful thing about having a stainless steel insert in the multi cooker is that you can put an immersion blender in and blend that up straight away the celery is for my juice <laughs> so there's not much celery left in fact my my kid was like mom can you leave a little bit so i can have some in my school lunch and i'm thinking of course i can i won't juice at all but um i love having some celery juice celery apple and ginger fantastic and onions keep those handy they're always good to have now i just bought brown onions but i like to mix them up in fact the last um onion the onions i bought were pink onions never had those before they were quite nice so i hope you enjoyed my shopping haul and Betty PT signing out.